Now, I know y'all probably saying, gang, like, damn, why the boy G-Stone up so early? Well, today was a special day for you, boy, gang. I was finally gonna get to see my cousin, Frank. And the homie Rio was finna get out today. Man, it was two blessings at once, man. I really couldn't believe it. So I get up, throw my stuff on, you feel me? I tell my girl, like, hey, babe, I'm finna get up out of here. I gotta go visit my cousin Frank in prison. But if you need anything, just let me know. I'm only a call away. Man, it feels just like yesterday. I was running the streets with them boys. But the homie Rio, he had been gone for two already. And my cousin Frank, he had been sitting on that thing for eight months. So many emotions are running through him, nigga, yeah, for real. It's like, damn, what I'm gonna say, you know what I'm saying, I was gonna feel. But I was real excited, regardless of the situation. So when as I walked in the visiting room and saying my cousin Frank, man, it looked like he was in good spirits. And this was a long time coming. Man, what's cracking, cuz? I see you done grew your hair out. Man, you looking good. How they treating you in here? Man, they ain't dying good, cuz. You know, they can lock my body, but they can't trap my mind, feel me? But man, it's good to see you, cuz. Oh, yeah. Damn, I got some good loads. Yo, big cousin might be out of here soon. Listen, cuz, I need you to do something for me. Damn, straight up. Man, cuz, that's what's up. You already know whatever you need is done. See, that's why I love you, cuz. I ain't never got a question if you down for me or not. I'm gonna have my lawyer get in touch with you with the details. Oh, yeah. Bet that, cuz. But, hey, when the last time you hollered that cuz a hand? Man, hell no, cuz. Fuck that nigga. You already know, me and him ain't been seeing eye to eye since that Lamar shit. I ain't got nothing to say to him. As far as I'm concerned, it's just you. Yeah, cuz, I get it, but I ain't gonna lie. He did anything he could for Lamar. And at the end of the day, we family. We all we got. Man, cuz, that nigga died to me the same day they laid my brother in that crown. Ain't no way I put you in charge, and you let that happen. I'll never forget that shit. And you know I'm standing on business, cuz. I at least had to give it a try, but hey, cuz, you know your little cousin started rapping. And I'm the hottest thing on these streets. Yeah, cuz, I heard you was fish grease out there, but hey, I'm finna get back to myself. Tell the homie Rio I said what's up and hold it down for him. It hurt to see my cuz walk back there, but I knew he was gonna be free in a minute anyways. But anyways, after that, I just posted up outside the prison to wait for the homie Rio to get out. Man, I hadn't seen my Loke in years. And he looked like he was so happy to get up out that thing. Cause just ain't know what was in store for him. Man, I'm so happy to be up out that thing. But what's cracking, Loke? Um, I see you getting all the money around this thing. And that's a clean ass truck on the set. Oh, this ain't nothing, cuz. But man, it's good to see you, my nigga, for real. Hey man, let's get up out of here, man. I got so much I gotta show you. Man, cuz I definitely gotta grab me one of these once I get out here in these streets and get my paper right. Oh yeah, appreciate it, cuz, but like I told you, this ain't nothing. Man, we having our way around the city. Just wait till we get back. Man, home sweet home. Now it's crazy. Even after all these years, cuz. 
Ain't nothing changed them in hood. No, cause you wrong. It done changed way more than you know. See, at this point, we no longer the little niggas that's from the set. At this point, we grown men. And the only thing we can do is boss up on these type. Step inside Auntie Crib with me real quick. Uh, Cousin Frank told me you was in joint stabbing on business, cuz. So my only question to you is if you ready to get out here and get some of this money with me. Come on now, cuz. You already know what it is, man. You know your boy came out here to get this paper. That's all I was thinking about in the joint. All right, my nigga, bet that. That's all I needed to hear. Shit, step into my office, cuz. All right, my nigga, so check this out. I feel like real niggas deserve rewards. So big game. I got three bricks right here for you, and I got 60 rats right here for you. Man, cuz, that's real nigga shit. But you already know, I'ma stay holding it down for mine, it's on the set. I'm a thoroughbred, this shit ain't on me, you see me? Oh no, I ain't a doubt in my mind, lo, but I also believe real niggas desire trophies too. So hey, cuz, you see that bag to the left of you right there? Reach in there, and whatever's in that bag, that's yours, my nigga. Ah, oh, no, man, yeah, you clowning, cuz, you done got your boy the iced out Cardi watch with the chain, with the iced out Cardi air buffs. You my nigga, man, you already know this shit cradle to the grave. Man, how I feel, lo. This is shit we used to dream about, and now it's a reality. Man, I couldn't imagine being out on these streets getting all this money in my left hand, man, as I ain't on. Hey, cuz, I ain't even know why. I feel like that nigga right now, for real. We is them niggas, cuz, and don't you ever forget that. Oh, yeah, and that work right there, man, you don't owe me a penny for that, man. That's a gift. We a family, my nigga, and family always take care of family. On the set, that's how we was brought up. You already know, my nigga, family. Come on, let me walk you outside real quick, cuz. Hey, Loke, I'ma get with you as soon as I get situated. You know I gotta go check on the fam now. Hey. I remember how you said you liked that truck earlier, cuz. Well, guess what? It's yours. Hey, don't type too long, man. We going out to celebrate tonight. It felt good being able to put my nigga on his feet fresh up out the joint. But I had other business to attend to, gang. I needed to go holler at the homie Polo and see if he had made any progress on finding them fools that had killed his pops and ran off with our work. Now you could tell my nigga Polo was ready to kill any and everything about this situation. Polo, what's the word, my nigga? Can tell me something good. Yeah, blood. Them niggas definitely pulled that move on my pops off the orders of that nigga headbuster. Man, I can't wait to catch that bitch. I'm putting him on the ground. Oh yeah, that's what you heard, my nigga? Okay, bet. Well, first step. We gon' find one of the niggas who had something to do with it, and we gon' have him confirm to us that it was the nigga headbuster that sent the hit. Now, I got a nigga who will be perfect for this job. Confirm? Man, ain't nothing to confirm, blood. We already know the niggas who did it. The only second step should be going to kill all them niggas, blood. And who is this nigga that you talking about that you got in mind for a job, blood? You know I'll just be dealing with everybody, man. Hey, listen, cuz, I don't just vouch for anybody. And if you go out there like that, man, you won't get yourself killed. Just meet us at the strip club later on tonight around 10. All right, blood, fuck it. Vanilla unicorn at 10. I could see Polo was frustrated with me, and it was understandable. The only thing I was trying to do was keep all of us from getting killed. We was getting attacked from both sides by both sets of hops. We needed to think smart.
Oh yeah, gang, my bad, I low forgot to tell y'all I was having a video shooting the hood today. With the homie ESTG and the homie Lud Dirk out there with me. This was the video for my newest single. And y'all know we was strapped out there in case the house tried to come through and send pop shots. Have you ever made a promise to never tell? Have you ever ran a fade in the county jail? Sitting in a cell, half a million dollar bill. Know you gon' prevail, but they got you on the shelf and single. I guess it's time for me to rap again. Freestyle over the phone, got bitches tapping in. Sneak dissing, got me clutching on my strap again. Please don't get me suiting up and all black again. All types of free me's, I'm a high demand. These boys live in fairy tales, you niggas Peter Pan. Hey bro, that's your enemy, why you ain't fight the man? You just told the whole door was on sight with him. Hey. Rimble cold, all these bitches want some pipe from him. Hey. Got a scar, but don't know nigga, want no fight from him. Hey. If I lose, I guarantee I take his life from him. Hey. On the streets, I shoot guns, I can't fight for shit. Hey. Why you wanna fight me, you should fight your bitch. You mad at the next nigga cause she like the dick. You better watch who you press and you might get hit. I don't wanna fade no more, you can fight the stick. This nigga wanna fade, I don't do no tapers. I just blew his mind out, it was a no brainer. Man, I swear these niggas broke, they don't get no paper. I ran it up by myself, I ain't get no favors. Sit on the bench and watch me ball like you supposed to. Stop acting tough up on the ground before I expose you. These four, five shells and nine shells are dome you. These bitches thinking that I want them, I just want cooch. Bitch, the only woman that I love is my fucking mama. Only bitch put money on my books was Latashiana. Keep a rocket in my pocket, any nigga want the drama. Any problems here, my nine are up and politely solve them. Hey. They don't know who killed that man, I'm the one who shot him. Hey. Where's the gun that you use? Bikini bottom. Hey. They don't know who stripped that boy, I'm the one who robbed him. Hey. Got Five had him running, I'm the one who caught him. Hey. I'm the reason why certain niggas is breathing still. I'm in the hood or at my granny's, I'm an easy kill. I do the killing when I'm sober, I don't need a pill. You niggas ain't living like that, let's just keep it real. I got a 4 5 Smith, ain't talking will. Banana clip on the chop, got niggas peel. All my ops that's alive, they live in fear. All these hollow tips and nines, they in careers. Play that rainbow in your car, his shit be knocking. He keep his foot on niggas' necks, he's Derek Chavin. I am not these other niggas, I'm really popping. Pop the nigga in the store and continue shopping. Sure. Now, while we out there shooting, my cousin Amp pull up in a cyber truck. So the director pissed, he like, cut, cut, I can't work under these conditions. I tell him, I'm like, I know, I know, chill, man. It's my people's everything good. We gonna continue the video shoot shortly, man. Just hold your horse. I sure hope this nigga don't know I went to visit cousin Frank earlier today. What's cracking, little cuz? Everything good? What you, you sure ain't been picking up the phone for me? And you ain't even tell your big cousin that you was having a video shoot today in the hood? My mind's crazy. Honestly, cuz, the only reason I ain't invite you out here to this video shoot is because I thought you would be doing something better like handling business, man. But you already know it's all I love with us, man. Man, I would hope not, cuz for real, G-Stone, me and you, we all we got out here in this world, cuz, for real. Oh, no, cuz, everything good? Matter of fact, let me introduce you to everybody. Ladies, Dirt, G, this my cousin Tiny Ann from 60s right here. A real boss, a real stepper, a real legend. Everything that we talk about on these rap songs, man. What's well, cracking, G? Nice to meet you, my nigga. Definitely a big fan of your music and your movement, man. Keep pushing. So, G, like, man, your little cousin ain't even have to make the introductions. Everybody in this town know who you is, huh? They say you running it out here. Hey, what's cracking, Smurf? Big fan of your music too, homie. Man, you definitely turned the streets up and you got them in a stranglehold. The voice. Don't let that momentum stop. So, Smurf Telly, appreciate the love, broski. You know I'ma keep teeing the streets up. Hey, cuz, let me holler at you real quick. All right, y'all. Everybody take a little break, man. We gonna continue this video show within the next 30 minutes, all right? I wonder what this nigga had to say now. And I was for sure he found out about me visiting Cousin Frank early. Hey, cuz, I solved our drought problem, man. I done ran into a plug with bowls of that ice, man. What's up, you want in? Ice, cuz? Yeah, I don't know how to move that, man. 
I think I'm gonna keep doing my thing with the lot. Ounces of soft I'll be getting from my people's mind. But you do your thing with it, though. Gee, yeah, nigga, it look like you move more than just a little couple ounces of soft. How you doing it out here, cuz? So what you trying to say, cuz? Cuz I think you really just mad cuz I ain't trying to deal with the ice. Look, I put up a bunch of money before the drought hit. That's how I'm doing what I'm doing right now. Yeah, all right, cuz. I hear you, man. Let me find out you done ran off and found you a plug by yourself and ain't cut me in. I'm gonna always cut you in. Matter of fact, cuz, come hop in this video with me. Have you ever made a promise to never tell? Have you ever ran a fade in the county jail? Sitting in a cell, half a million dollar bill. Know you gon' prevail, but they got you on the shelf as single. I guess it's time for me to rap again. Freestyle over the phone, got bitches tapping in. Sneak this and got me clutching on my strap again. Please don't get me suiting up and all black again. All types of free me's, I'm a high demand. These boys live in fairy tales, you niggas Peter Pan. Hey bro, that's your enemy, why you ain't fight the man? You just told the whole door nose on sight with him. Hey. Rimble cold, all these bitches want some pipe from him. Hey. Got a Scarble, don't know, nigga want no fight from him. Hey. If I lose, I get I'm gonna get up out of here, cuz, but if you change your mind about that thing, get with me. You already know I will. But see safe out there on them streets, cuz. I love you, boy. Call me later. All right, everybody, director, man. Let's get back to shooting this music video, man. Cuz we ain't finna be out here all day. Time is money, man. No, I ain't know what cuz angle was, but I was gonna be keeping my eye on him. Yeah, he knew something. Hey, who was that speeding up in that Hellcat, cuz? I don't like that. I ain't gonna lie, gang. I was ready to upload her. Hey, Smurf, this for you, cuz? Who was this? He like, oh yeah, broski, everything good. That's just V-Roy clowning. I told him I was up here with you, and he wanted to show love to the movement. Yeah, right, cuz. That's Vaughn for real. Show enough, it was him. So he like, hey Vaughn, this G-Stone right here. The one I said reminded me of you. He got the whole city teeing up to his music. I'm trying to get him to sign that OTF. Vaughn, what's cracking, my nigga? And it's good to finally meet you, cuz. Big fan of your music. And it was only right when that boy Smurf said I reminded him of you. He telling me, like, yeah, broski. I see the movement. I see the visual. And it looked like you official with it, man. You know, I'm rocking with that. So me and cuz just sitting up there chopping it up for a minute, you feel me? And I tell him, I'm like, cuz, you gotta get in the video. He like that, broski. Have you ever made a promise to never tell? Have you ever ran a fade in the county jail? Sitting in a cell, half a million dollar bill. Know you gon' prevail, but they got you on the shelf as single. I guess it's time for me to rap again. Freestyle over the phone, got bitches tapping in. Sneak this and got me clutching on my strap again. Please don't get me suiting up and all black again. All types of free me's, I'm a high demand. These boys live in fairy tales, you niggas Peter Pan. Hey bro, that's your enemy, why you ain't fight the man? You just told the whole door nose on sight right? with him. Hey. Rimble cold, all these bitches want some pipe from him. Hey. Got a Scarble don't know, nigga want no fight from him. Hey. If I lose, I guarantee I take his life from him. Hey. On the streets, I shoot guns, I can't fight for shit. Hey. Why you wanna fight me? You should fight your bitch. You mad at the next nigga cause she like the dick. You better watch who you press and you might get hit. I don't wanna fade no more, you can fight the stick. This nigga wanna fade, I don't do no tapers. I just blew his mind out, it was a no-brainer. Man, I swear these... So anyways, we finished the video, and after that, I get a call from Frank Lawyer telling me to go meet somebody behind the old Smirnoff building down the street from the hood. When I get back there, I see a lady cop out there smoking a cigarette. It looked like a setup at first, but I already know cuz ain't on that. So what's up? You supposed to have something for my cousin Frank? I sure do. You see those documents right there? They proved that the feds framed your cousin Franklin for that gun and those drugs that were found in his car. Oh yeah, that's great news then. Man, I knew cuz would never be riding around like that. He know better. Yeah, me and your cousin go way back. Make sure his lawyer gets those files. This was a surreal moment for me, gang. Man, my cousin Frank was finally finna be free for real.
So anyways, after that, I peeled off to go drop them papers off to Franklin lawyer. Later on that night, it was time to celebrate the homie Rio freedom and to set up a meeting between me, Rio, and Polo to figure out how we was gonna take care of these ops. Hey, baby, check this out. I'm gonna need you to give me and the fellas a little bit of privacy. I'm gonna come back later and get you. Don't worry. We tipping or I'm right here. Oh, no, what's cracking, my nigga? Take a seat. Hey, Polo, this my nigga Rio that just got out the joint. Cuz down with me now. He definitely getting at the with that blower. Rio, this the homie Polo from Inglewood Families. He one of the ones that we do mess with. We do real good business, man. I call it this meeting because I thought we could all help each other out. Ah, uh, yeah, old Lord, cuz. What's going on? Man, you ain't tell me the nigga that we was meeting with was a op. Rio, listen, cuz. Fuck all that. Like. The homie Polo right here, he one of them real ones. This nigga done saved my life a couple times, man. And I'm vouching for him with you, just like I vouch for you with him. And it's about the bigger picture, man. Fuck all this beef, man. Hey, G, what's up with your homie right here, blood? And this nigga don't even know me, and he trying to call me a op. Yeah, I see it was a big mistake coming here. Yeah, it definitely was, cuz. But go ahead and get up out of here while it's safe for you. Cuz unlike my homie, I ain't with that kumbaya shit. Hey, blood, ain't no hoe with me either, my nigga. But I ain't come here to argue with you. I came here to handle some real business. But if you want to get on that, we can get on that. That's whatever. I ain't never been scared. Acts about me around my way. Just like you certified around your way, yeah, I get active with that blower. All right, man, stop the fucking bullshit and arguing and listen to what I gotta say. I check this out, Polo. Me and Rio, we gonna help you with that problem that you dealing with in your hood. In exchange, you gonna help us in taking down them fools from over. Damn, I like right, my nigga, you ain't gotta yell at us. Hey, my bad, Paulo. Anything I might have said to you before, let's leave that in the past and let bygones be bygones. Hey, it's all good, blood. The homie G Stone was like that at first, too. But then, bro seen the bigger picture that red and blue make green. And that's all that matters. All right, check this out. So, this how we gonna do this. Polo. I got a tip on one of the fools that has something to do with killing your pops. Me and Rio gonna go lay on him and catch him down bad and make him tell us where them boys hide in they spot at. Okay, blood. I mean, if you think that's our best approach, all right, cuz. I'm with it then. You know, I'm always ready to light a murder like game a down on somebody. You gotta make sure I ain't rusty. All right, blood. I'm with that. So what you need me to do then? All right, cuz. So once we get the location of they spot out of door, I'ma call you, and I'ma have you pull up to whatever location I send you and scope it out and let me know what's going on. All right, gang, so we all in agreement, right? Good. Well, let's have fun the rest of the night, and we gonna get straight to business in the morning. Let's show these fools what happen when you fuck with anybody on our team. So that next morning, me and the homie Rio was in slide mode, and we was right down the street with one of the fools that had something to do with Polo Pops getting killed. Oh yeah, cuz, this nigga slipping. He don't even know that we watching. I already know, but this the plan, cuz. You gonna go to the back and hit the cut and come around. Me, I'm gonna approach that nigga straight up and see what he do. If he try to run, you'll be right there to catch his ass. Alright, let's get it then, bro. Alright, cuz, as soon as you hop out the car, I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna count up three. One, two, three. What's cracking, home? A little birdie told me that you one of the niggas who had something to do with my nigga Polo Pops today. Man, that nigga was looking pokey as hell, and he did exactly what I thought he was gonna do in Ram. Man, get your little bitch ass on the ground, nigga. All right, nigga, check this out. That's how this about to go. I'm gonna ask you a few questions, and depending on how you answer, you either gonna die, or you gonna get to keep your life. The choice is yours, though. They like, all right, man, what you gotta ask me? First thing I wanna know is why that nigga headbuster put the play down on my nigga Polo Pops. Second off, I wanna know where that nigga keeping all his work at. 
Hurry up and answer, nigga, for I have my loke right there put a hobble in your head. He like, all right, check this out. So the shit with Polo Pops, that only happened because he was doing business with you. And here, Busta know that y'all had some of his cousins, your hood, get killed. And then on the spot, I heard they got one of East Lopes, the whole warehouse. See? Now, how hard was that? The information with that warehouse better check out, too. Otherwise, me and my homie gonna spend the block. And when we come back, you already know you dying. Don't play with us, nigga. So you gonna let me go, right? Yeah. You know what? I'm a man of my word. I am gonna let you go. Cause you definitely serves your purpose, homie. I don't. Get up out of here. Man, thank you, homie. You will never see me again. I promise. All right. Come on, Riel. Let's get up out of here, Lo. That nigga should have knew he wasn't getting away from playing with the fan. And we left him slumped in the back alley. Hey, Paolo, I got some good news for you, my nigga. We found that fool, and he told us that they got a spot in East Los. It's an old warehouse. Now look, only thing I need you to do is go scope out the spot. Do not do nothing crazy, man. I know you want to get revenge, but we got to do it the right way. Otherwise, we gonna end up taking other losses in this war. Just be patient, my nigga, at the end. We gonna get revenge for your pops, and we gonna run the city. All right, blood. I'm gonna go scope it out and let you know what I find. At this point, we was close as hell to putting that fool greedy in the barn and that fool head was. So later on that day, the homie Polo went and scoped out the warehouse that dude told us about. And sure enough, it was their warehouse. No fools were standing out there just ready to get murked. I know Polo was ready to just hop out and get to shooting. I just had to hope that revenge didn't cloud his judgment to that point. Hey, blood. Yeah, the info that you gave me earlier, it checked out. Man, hairbuster and greedy out here right now. All y'all have to do is pull up and we can kill everybody out here and be done with this situation. Man, hell no, cuz. Get your ass up out of there, man. We ain't just finna run in like that, man. We gotta have a plan. Get back to the spot, man, and we gonna figure it out. Man, all right, blood. I got you. I'm finna get up out of here. But we gotta handle this situation as soon as possible. Now it's time to get active, gang. Man, these fools ain't even know that we had to drop on them. 